hello guys hello so good evening so just i was leaving the office so just wanted to check the kea website once again if there are any updates came across the objection link and making a quick video in order to uh, make you people understand a bit more about it and how to file the objection so now uh, yesterday the key answers were let out by the kea board and uh, to our surprise <laughs> a lot of questions were marked with the wrong answers and we had also seen it in the yesterday video where i had asked you people not to panic because yes there is a lot of errors over there and since the objection link is open today i'm just going to access you like how you can start filing it up and uh, what to do next okay fine so with this said uh, so where you can find this link you can find it over in the kea website under admission section pgcet 2023 this will open up the window over here here the objection link is available for 2023 key answers and this is the screen how it will look okay this is the screen how it will look and you can just start filling up your cet number your application number your name of the candidate father's name date of birth mobile number email id and your course and the paper and the subject i'll just confirm it okay so as of now you just fill up if it is a logical and all these things you just fill it up okay else you can uh, just fill it up as the mba that itself you can fill it up the question paper version as of now it should have been given as a1 b1 c1 d1 for mba and mca people it is given as a1 a2 a3 a4 i don't know with which mind they were working on it <laughs> i am not sure about it but still uh, for a1 just mark it a1 for b1 mark it a2 for c1 mark it a3 for d1 mark it a4 okay because in your omr sheet or in a question paper nothing is mentioned regarding a2 a3 a4 so it's a mistake it's a mistake from there and right? let me just check it out so next is given the question number so all these are some rough data which i was using to help you people out okay so the question number you just need to mention the question number the candidate key answer what is your answer according to you and the reasons for objection what is it you need to just fill it up and then you need to upload a document of the proof where you need to solve the question on a sheet take a picture of it upload it as the proof over here okay so how to do a sample question number candidate things i'll just show it to you first let us go back to our uh, key answers and let us check what is happening over there okay so now for that let us go back to our key answers and this is the provisional key answer list which is being released by <coughs> the ke okay this is for mca for pgcet and i am having a question paper version of c1 c1 okay so according to this some random question number 7th this is what i felt very bad okay so the seventh question which is for 5 plus 3 multiplied by 8 minus 12 divided by 4 equal to 3 this is a very simple rule of b board mass okay so i don't think anyone would be making any kind of mistake over here so now they have given the key answers according to mca for c1 is your Seventh is going to be B. Let us just check it out. For seventh, if it is going to be B, it won't solve the question. If you want to just cross check and see, find out what is the answer, you can go to some random website also. You can just put this question; it is available. So five plus three into eight minus twelve divided by four equal to three. So the answer over here is given as B. That is nothing but minus and divide. Okay. So now when we interchange the things, it becomes. 5 plus 3 into 2 by 3 minus 4 into 3 equal to 3 where it is equal to 3 equal to 3 now i don't know if they had just seen this option as b and just marked it over there because the options given over here are in the different sequence and the question asked here are in a different sequence if they have marked it according to this answer as b god help them so i am not sure what kind of silly mistakes they have made this time it is very disheartening to see it and a lot of students are being affected due to this and similar way there are a lot of questions which needs to be objected and 
it is not the duty of the student after spending so much of time in the preparation and everything again going back to the basics again drawing and cross checking writing down the answers uploading it come on ka if you are watching this video and if you are coming across it kindly make the students life much more better so it is going to be easier for them else each and every time objecting and uploading objecting uploading it's not our work man come on so the students have already spent a lot of time in uh figuring out how to crack the exam so again going back to these things it is disheartening okay so in this way you can find out these questions and then you can come back to our uh, <coughs> question paper here and you can fill up this is going to be option number 7 candidate answer key is going to be our option is going to be option number d the reason is going to be when we apply board mass answer comes to be comes to be option d you can solve it in a sheet upload it as a jpeg file over here and you can submit it this needs to be done for each and every question yes i know it is going to be hectic so do let your friends also know and put the questions and find out and do it because when the students do only they take it up seriously okay so do it so don't get disheartened it happens and being a reputed board they should have taken these into consideration and made it out and made it much more better but nothing can be done now happened is happened so we just need to stick on with this and go on with the process so don't uh, get stressed up it is a long weekend enjoy your time and uh, spend a lot of time in upskilling yourselves and start focusing on some better path okay some better path in the sense some upskilling things so that is what is from my end in case if you are finding any kind of difficulties further going on you can just let us know we'll be more than happy to help you out i am lakshman here so so we are from the institute called as learn group we do training for mba mca banking and law all these entrance exams so you can reach out to us in case if you want any kind of assistance in any kind of programs also we do career guidance so me myself being an engineer have gone through a lot of things so i know what is what needs to be done in order to make yourself better so do let us know we'll be more than happy to help you thank you very much so keep up so uh, don't get stressed take care bye bye see ya in the next video bye bye see ya